the power that creates goodwill and healthy humanity will create and change the pattern. It happens no other way. It's not going to happen because we're fighting against the evil of those who aren't paying attention and are being destructive. We have to be the radiant ones in the situation holding the pattern. I have a couple of friends who um, were on Facebook who I love very dearly, and their shirts said, the future is the feminine. I'm old enough to have participated in women's lib. Some of you in the room probably did as well. And if you think of the future being feminine because we are the bodies that are going to produce the babies and raise them, in some ways that's true. But I want to put out there the future is men and women who live in integrity. And as a woman, I don't know how to do this without men who, who love what I love. And I need them, desperately. Again, this isn't anti the choice. It's pro-creative thinking. It's pro-support for that which is healthy and wholesome and is in place to bring mastery. When you're going through hell, you got to keep on going because hell sometimes is just the fact that the factors aren't in place yet. But you being there and bringing your radiant spiritual expression into it, keeping on going, the circumstances won't be able to cling on you. You're like Teflon when you're doing that. You just keep moving, and the experience is creation is happening because you're moving, not because you've sat still trying to figure out all the factors. I don't know, know how many times I've spent the night wondering, what is this hell I'm in? Where I'm actually trying to discern, how did I get here? What did I do? Who is it? And, and eventually I wake up in the morning and realize it really doesn't matter because I've got to live my life and bring myself into this circumstance. And the hell is often because I wasn't in it. <laughs> it's not because of the people or the circumstance or what I ate or the amount of money in my bank account. It's because I forgot to show up, and this feels like hell. It feels like hell when I don't show up. There's mastery in knowing how to be in position, no matter what the factors are, and be radiant and let your spiritual expression. And what is that? What is your spiritual expression? It is the spirit you're choosing to express. Your spiritual expression can change everything. Fighting is a great fertilizer for hate. Passion is different than fighting. I don't think anyone can accuse me of not being passionate about the things I think are important. And I know how to say no louder than most people because I've had to say it a lot in my life. No way. You can put in whatever word you want there. No stinking way. No, no, absolutely no. And I can tell you, I put my body between the ugly and its path more times than I'd like to remember. Well, I don't mind remembering them because I'm still here. And I'll do it again. That which is ugly and untrue and hateful, no way. No way is it getting past me. doesn't mean I'm going to fight it, but I'm not going to also allow it to go past me without a positive, radiant expression of myself in its face. Standing in your own presence and letting your radiance be there allows them to know there is another way. I'm not fighting them. I'm inviting them. Invite them into the passion of being a creator being that says, it is possible to reclaim this world in the name of what is holy, because I have. <laughs>